long way. Here we go. Tip, please. Gracias, yeah, yo. Hey. Uh, fuck off, Luis. Ay, Dios mío, haven't we been through this already? Been through the fact that you wanted to kill me? Been through the fact that you're far from alone that desire? This is over. It's over. I just want to go someplace far away from here and quietly wait to die. I lived it. I lived it hard, and now I'm ready to end it. Oh, shut up, you hysterical fucking queen. Get a grip, bro. Oh, yes. Silly me. <laughs> Silly fucking me. <laughs> the Russian mob want me dead. My best friend just contemplated murdering me. The mob are on my case. I'm massively in debt, and, and I just lost $2 million worth of diamonds. Any other man would just dust himself off and carry on. Look, uh, okay, I'm sorry I thought about killing you. I really am. But if you keep up with the bullshit, I might have to kill you for real. Fuck off, Luis! No, you fuck off, Tony. I didn't kill you. I wanted to. Why? Because you've become a useless junkie fuck. That's why. But I didn't. And now, it's you and me against the world, okay? And if your brains ain't working right, then I'll make the decision for us, okay? It's Bulgarin or us. Or you can shoot us both and make his life easy for him. Well, you're kind of clever, aren't you? I only hired you because I thought you were dumb. Yeah, thank you very much. You're welcome very much. Are you coming now? Yes, I'm coming now. Well, let's go, come on. I heard Bulgarian was moving some smack at it to Funland on Firefly Island. So, say we find them, what are we gonna do then? We're gonna take out their income stream, and then we're gonna take them out. End this bullshit. Okay, I'm armed, I'm dangerous, let's fucking do this! Monty, give me a break. What? We're in this together! Tony, bro, I love you, but I shall handle this alone. I don't want you getting yourself killed. Then you're gonna have to punch me out again, Lou. Don't make me, man. You know you're just gonna slow me down, bro, and kill us both. I want at least one of us to survive. Lou? Look, T. Don't go home. Don't go to the clubs. Don't go nowhere anyone might conceivably think to look for you. There aren't many places like that left in the city, I'm afraid. Oh, Come on. Where do you think you can hide that no one would expect? I have no fucking clue. Uh, Dukes? I ran away from there when I was a kid, and I swore blind I'd never go back, apart from to catch a plane. Okay, cool. Hit up, like, uh, that monoglow monument thing in Meadows Park. Hang out for a few hours. If I survive this shit, I'll find you. If I don't show, then I'm gone. Move to Brazil. Move somewhere. You'll never look back, T. I thought I was the annoying drama queen in this pairing. I'm serious, T. This is my last testament. Yo, send some money to my mom some... Later, T. Shit, Lou. Look after yourself. Now Raskolov is dead, we have sole claim to the junk. We got a score, sir. Tried to kill me. 
I got you! Come on! Come on! Come on! Can't talk, bro. It's just really coming apart. What do you need? Let me help you out. There ain't nothing you can do, Yusuf. If this crazy Russian fuck manages to leave the country, it's over for me at all. I gotta get down to Dush Expressway without any number of Russian assassins taking me down. Or we're done. Why am I even saying this? Wish me luck, bro.
guy. Proceed to highlighted route. Calculate. 
Shit. Sorry, Pops. Oh. Come on, get up. Get up. You okay? Yeah, thanks. Take care of yourself, okay? Stay away from idiots like me. Fuck you. You always have to make a scene, don't you? Yeah, I know. It's a real problem with me, you know? I wish I was more like you. Subtle, shy, retiring. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> oh, boy. I used to play around here when I was a kid, dreaming of the world, wondering what it was like at that place over there or that little island over there. You ever go that thing? Nah, I went to Algonquin instead, waiting for the world to come to me. You did it, man. You did it. You, you saved my life. You, you saved the business. You, you fucking did it. Hey, man, I did what I could, bro. I'm proud of you, man. Thank you. But I don't want you to get a big head. I don't want you to go uh, change, become a megastar, go to Vinewood, write a blog. Oh. <laughs> You're a pill-popping old queen, man. I'm a murdering maniac. But we survived, bro. We survived. We did more than survive, amigo. We prospered. We took on this town and we won. We took on this place and we gave it the fucking finger. Fuck you all! I don't care what people say. Tony Prince and Luis Lopez could not be stopped. Huh? Oh, jeez, who's this? What's up, my niggas? Oh, did he just say that? Uh, yeah, hey, man. You fucking made it. Man, that was some serious gangster shit. Shoot, shoot, shoot him up. I said shoot, shoot, shoot him up. <laughs> Yo, T, T, give me a hug, give me a hug. Not too close, though. I don't want to give my father the wrong impression. Ah, Luis, I love you, man. I love you. I love you, too. I love everyone. Come on, let's get out of here. Oh, by the way, I think my father may be into franchising clubs. <laughs> I know. Franchise is not the way to go. The, the club is all about the people. Fuck the people. Fuck them all. We pat your dick and piss all over them. <laughs> You're going to go a long way in hospitality, my friend.
successful and very popular international superhero. Thanks, mate. Beat on the chain, fill your brain. Hey, Steve! How are you, mate? It's so good to see you. Yeah, it's Luis. <laughs> How are you, Daisy? You never call me. Sorry, Leslie. Yeah, I'm great, marvelous. Listen, have you got any coke? No, I'm sorry. <laughs> Not to worry, I don't need it. I'm more or less stop doing it now. I only do it at night now. It's so good to see you, darling. How is darling Terry? You mean Tony? <laughs> I love that man. Just a shame, he's a pup. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a lot of people say that about him. Anyway, I thought you said you were going back to London. Uh, I did. Yes, I did. <laughs> I came back. <laughs> I was actually just about to call you when my phone got stolen. <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> Well, I didn't know we were being filmed. Was that your fucking hand job? Oh, fucking cunt! What's wrong? Oh, my fiance. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. What? Shit! You said that. Oh, my fiance. Fuck. Listen. God, when you say it out loud, it sounds really awful. And I'm not a slapper. A what? So, anyway, I was really drunk. But anyway, you know Chris Hunt? The gay action star? He's not gay. He's a virile man who takes an interest in personal grooming and likes gladiators. But yes, he's probably a bender. So anyway, I got off with him, ended up getting taped, and now he's going to leak it online to prove he's straight. Now wake up! <laughs> the classic blind beard. Oh, and if my fiance finds out, I'll be buggered. Oh, please, please, darling, I need your help. Fine. Oh, come on, let's go. Man, I wish we had some coke. We need to find this twat. Fuck! You don't know where he is? He's always on that bloody bleater website. We'll wait until he bleats and then we should be able to find him. Let me look at that thing. He posted from a, a bathroom on Middle Park Views. We should head uptown. He's bleating. Marcus asked me if I hang left or right, and I told him to find out for himself. What could that possibly mean? I think he's getting his inner seat measured a tailor. All Chris's suits are made by that darling little man of Perseus. We should go there. He's getting his tailor to check his Johnson? And you say this guy ain't gay? All I know is I wanked him off, okay? I mean, you and I had sex and you're a bit fruity, so it wouldn't exactly be a first. You say so. Oh, sugar, that's sweet, but a girl knows. <laughs> then maybe I've been hanging out with Tony too long. Or maybe it's you. Is your fiancé gay too? Is that like a fetish for you? Oh, Bertie's had some flings, but he's pretty much 70% hetero. As much as any... Another bleat! Oh, 
bugger! Missed him, did we? Apparently his fingers haven't smelled this fishy since he last crossed over. Good for him. He must be at Squid Row, that budget seafood place. He loves slumming it there for some reason. Yo, okay. Worst case scenario, the video comes out. You lay low for a while, maybe get a reality TV show. The new American dream. Perfect, sweetie. Just what I want. Mummy and Daddy would be so proud. Some other girls would kill to be in your position. Think of it that way. Enjoy the ride. Good for those tramps. I'm a respectable woman. I've had $200,000 spent on my education. Daddy's got a peerage. Ah, it was Babe of the Month, for God's sake. I don't want to be famous for tossing up some sodomite. Jesus, I need some coke. Fuck! Your fucking Spanish gave me some! <laughs> fucking cunting shit! He's posted another bleat. Apparently he's premiering his new movie in Star Junction. Star Junction it is, then. And if I wish it then. Pretty much. They've always been like that, haven't they? Okay, come on. Let's see if we can talk some sense into him. Chris, you cunting fuck! Hand over the tape! Too late, Dolly. You're gonna be famous. Check it! Oh my god! Is that my minge? He's ten feet high! You really? Want to wank? <laughs> We're not twelve. Give me some digits too, baby. Three of them. Fuck, fuck, fuck! My life is over! Who's game now, bitches? See you later, babe. Couldn't have happened to a nicer person. Hey, have you a light? Hey, sorry, Papi, I don't smoke. Ah, a Spaniard, wonderful, a man of culture. I'm not sure <laughs> someone from the heights qualifies as being Spaniard, but whatever. Oh, exactly, whatever, whatever you say, Daddy. Excuse me? What is wrong with you? The British, they give you this beautiful, if a little awkward language, and you just debase it with whatever, or like, or fuck you, or get over yourself. In that <laughs> case, fuck you. Oh, c'est ça, oh, va te faire foutre. Oh, who am I to complain? My country is not much better. We are the worst. My people watch American television and then they complain about it afterwards. Oh la la, I am rich! Uh, time was when we would chop someone's head off and we would run around the street with it on a stick. Vive la France! Now, we are soft and miserable just like you. Hey, I'm not miserable. Well, then clearly you do not watch enough television. <laughs> you enjoy the, the bright lights and the big cities and the hope that maybe one day you become rich and stupid and, and your people. Maybe you can make a nice little TV show with you and your friends. Hey, knowing my friends, I hope not. <laughs> well, I do not come to Liberty City uh, to watch television. I come to fuck and get high. What else is there? Well, I don't know. Family? I had a family. Meaningless. Honor? Psst. Don't make me puke. No, mon ami. I had to tell you, my friend. Nothing matters in this world apart from getting your rocks off. Or getting so out of it you don't realize you haven't got your rocks off. <laughs> I like a man who's so focused. <laughs> Have you got a car? I'm not sure I want to get into a car with someone like you. Oh, <laughs> relax, relax. Uh, let's go for a drive. I like you. Uh, you find things as, as ridiculous as me. I have an appointment at the Hyatt Massage Spa on Diamond Street.
Can I buy a massage for you? Uh, it's the least I can do considering your many kindnesses. Nah, I'm cool, bro. I don't need no slave labor fluffing me. <laughs> I like things giving up willingly. As you wish, but uh, there are pleasures distinct to the professional mistress. Uh, you may come to understand that in later years, uh, Spaniard. <laughs> yeah, okay, Frenchman. Thank you, Spaniard. I am only sorry you will not join me in this adventure. Don't catch nothing, bro. Sacrifice no frogs for me, mommy. Listen, I thought you should know that things is cool with Tony now. It looks like we might be okay. What are you doing with that man? Why don't you go to college like a good boy? Mommy, I thought you wanted me to respect him. You can respect him from a college library, not just the bandstand of his nightclub. Bandstand? <laughs> Your mayor. Look, I can never win with you. I love you, mommy. I love you, hijo. Goodbye, have a nice day. 